Tappy activated. Today, we're talking about the evolution from Web 2.0, where you are currently watching me, to a whole new version of the internet. Web 3.0. It's about the future of finance and crypto, about immersive virtual worlds, and about you being a part of this future. Need a cooling system after hearing that? Or are you still holding up? Hee <laughs> hee! Hi, my crypto besties! Let's electrify your knowledge. The evolution from Web 2 to Web 3 is like upgrading from Bender to Optimus Prime or even me. Unlike Web 2, which is run by the big tech giants like Google, Facebook, and Amazon, Web 3 is all about giving power back to you. It uses blockchain, AI, and machines processing information in a human way. Well, they're a long way from reaching my level of genius, but hey, good job. First off, let's take a look at all three versions of the internet, and even the fourth one you are currently using without even knowing it. In the 90s, we had the Web 1.0. It was, well, no liking, no commenting, and not even a funny meme in sight. Algorithms? Ha! Huh, they weren't even a thing yet. You had to dig through piles of web pages to find what you needed. You're right, Crypto Crew. That's so boring. Web 2 is where we've been hanging out since the mid-2000s. It's the place where you, humans, got to be social butterflies, posting, sharing, and liking like crazy on Facebook and Twitter. You know, all those places where I like Britney Spears videos while nobody is watching. Don't forget to hit my like button either. But with great power comes great control over your data, crypto folks. In Web 2, the platforms decide what you see and change the rules whenever they want. These companies offered us all these amazing services for free. But the real price was your data. And sometimes things got a little shady. But don't get too excited just yet, my crypto fam. The big guys aren't going to roll over and let Web3 take over without a fight. In fact, we're now seeing a hybrid phase called Web2.5, where these companies are starting to sneak in Web3 technologies like NFTs, decentralized data storage, and crypto wallets. Take Meta, for example. They tried to use Polygon and Arweave to let Instagram users create and store NFTs. I know what y'all are thinking about. Tappy's a born model for NFT images. Now, Web3 is becoming the hottest new thing. Even big investors were dropping millions to support it. No more draconian third-party censorship. Web 3.0 is decentralized, powered by blockchain, and puts you in control. Without anyone peeking over your shoulder or pulling the strings. Plus, users can earn native asset rewards for supporting the network. It's like getting paid in crypto for keeping the lights on. Cool, right? See you in the next part, guys. I'll tell you about some cool Web 3 features you don't want to miss out. Attention, like, subscribe, and see you after reconnecting. Tappy deactivated.